Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In this video, we are going to be talking about one of my all-time favorite things in the world, which is denim. Specifically, in today's video, I am taking five of my favorite styles of denim for spring that I'm constantly in rotation on, and I'm going to show you how I like to style them. We'll be sharing with you a lot of my do's. I don't have many don'ts. I hate telling people what not to do. I'm a big believer and if you're comfortable in it and if that's your style then you rock it. It is not my place to tell you guys what to do with your style but I will tell you some of my personal do's and don'ts and you can follow me if you want to but if not then just take whatever I say and just throw in the trash. <laughs> you do you. Do what you like to do. First pair of denim that I have is the cropped flare. Whenever I style this denim, I'm usually going to an event, I'm going on a date. This is my go-to dressy pair of denim. When it comes to shoes for this certain pair of denim, I like to stay away from ankle boots just because I feel like it makes my legs look a lot shorter. I like to do something with a platform, a sandal of some sort. To have a fun pair of denim such as a cropped flare, you really don't need a ton of styling. I mean, you could obviously do a fun jacket, you can do whatever you want, but it's not necessary. You don't really need to put a whole lot of effort into the styling. Maybe you just do a basic top, layer on some jewelry, and your jeans really speak for the whole entire outfit. Next style of denim I have is the culottes. And I've had these for, I've had these before culottes came back into style. I've had these for like five years. So whenever I would wear these, people would be like, um, are you okay? What are you wearing? <laughs> They're comfortable. This is another pair of denim that I do like to dress up and dress down. I feel like this pair looks great either way. I can throw on like a ripped graphic t-shirt and some sneakers and I'm good to go run errands. Or like today, I'm gonna be styling it with a denim shirt dressed up with a pair of heels. Shoes, I again, try to stay away from ankle boots. If I do an ankle booty, it's gotta be something tight at the ankle just because you kind of get lost in shoe and jean when you are styling these. So I try to show as much of my ankle as possible. When it comes to layering jackets over this, I know it's a rule to not wear a big flowy jacket when you are wearing such a wide pant, but I do like to do a kimono every now and then, but for the most part, I do a cropped jacket just because you wanna see your waist, you wanna see, you wanna see that you have a body and legs and hips in the jeans. It's rare that I do a kimono, but if I'm feeling kinda, you know, sassy, I might throw a kimono over it. So my next three jeans kind of live in the same family and oftentimes are confused with each other. To show you the girlfriend, the boyfriend, and the straight leg and tell you the differences between the three. Start with the straight leg. Basically a jean that is tight in the waist, tight in the butt, tight in the hips, but just goes straight down. Tight in the leg, but just goes straight down. And this is a jean that you can pretty much treat like a skinny jean. All rules apply, you can pretty much wear any shoe with it, except I would stay away from wide ankle boots, and I would stay away from over the knee boots, because then you're just shoving your jean into it. I would stick with the skinnies for that type of shoe. Bring the top, you can pretty much wear anything. You can do a long top, you can do a short top. This is so tight in the leg, right here that you can cover this part up without losing yourself in the fabric. Today I'm styling these guys with just a basic white tank, a linen jacket, and a pair of heels. And since I'm not super tall, I'm 5'5", five five, I do like to wear some sort of block heel when I am wearing a jean like this. This is a jean that you can dress up or down as well. So, you know, I do own maybe four pairs of straight leg jeans because I do keep them on rotation for when I'm dressing casual or dressing up. we're gonna do is the boyfriend jean and I have these guys from Revolve this is the brand girlfriend and they make great denim Boyfriend jean is pretty much baggy all around um, I like my boyfriend jeans to fit me a little bit in the hips so they aren't completely sliding down but they're pretty much baggy everywhere else they're not tapered at the bottom they're straight down you can cuff them um, if you would like depending on what shoe you're wearing if you're wearing an ankle boot I would definitely give them a little cuff so you can see a little bit of your ankle but I like to style these with just a 
white tee tucked in, something basic tucked in. I feel like when you're wearing something tucked out of a boyfriend jean, there is just too much fabric going on. You can style a jacket with these. I just wouldn't do something um, with a lot of fabric. I would do something cropped. I would do something a little tailored in the arms, something to show that you have a body everywhere else. The last pair of denim that I have is the girlfriend jean, which the girlfriend jean is going to be the same as the boyfriend jean, except the bottom is tapered. With the girlfriend jean, the leg gets a little bit tapered towards the bottom. It fits you a little bit better in the hips and the butt and the waist, a little tighter than the boyfriend jean. So think of the girlfriend jean as just a smaller version of the boyfriend jean. I know, this is so confusing. But the girlfriend jean is probably one of my favorites because when I'm wearing skinny jeans, I don't love wearing a crop top and like having my butt and everything exposed. I don't know, I'm just weird like that. So I can definitely feel comfortable wearing a crop top and a girlfriend jean because I know my the jeans aren't so tight on my butt and on my legs. So it almost acts as like a jogger, if you will. So I really love these. These are one of my favorite pairs and um, these are by BDG and they make the best girlfriend jeans. That is why I styled them with just a cropped graphic tee and some sneakers. I love dressing these down, but again, you can dress these up as well. So that's the great thing about this style of jean. I have showed you guys my favorite pairs of jeans for spring. I would like to know what styles you guys are loving right now and how you like to style them. Am I missing something? I know I'm missing the skinny jean, but I feel like that's kind of everyone's go-to is the skinny jean. So I really wanted to show you guys something different um, other than a skinny. And we are doing a full page on denim in the Life by Her lookbook next month. We always try to do a denim of some sort in the magazine, um, but this next month is gonna be a four page spread on denim alone with lots of inspiration, shopping links, and stuff like that. So you don't wanna miss that but I will put um, the site right here as well as below in the description box so go check it out but I will see you guys next time bye